Bersuk ba kami? Duara ka lang sa dagat. This is all you can eat barbecue na kasama sa entrance fee which is 300. But you can also pay for just the entrance fee to the flower farm and that will cost 150 NT. And that's per person. Si boy chef logro. Si logro. Yum 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 yum. Oh, mga batak yang ano pa. And here we are sa loob ng flower farm. Chongshe Flower Farm. Puntahan din to ng mga Filipinos. Yan o. This farm is open all year round and the flowers here are seasonal. So, kahit anong season, pag pumunta ka dito, there's always gonna be flowers. But maganda pag pumunta kayo ng spring because there's many varieties na makikita niyo. This farm has improved over the years and marami na silang nilagay na mga Instagrammable spaces that is really good for picture taking. A lot of couples actually use this um, farm for their prenup or wedding photo shoot. May iba naman para sa debu. You can also visit their nursery, yung mga seedlings pa lang ng mga bulaklak nila. And their rose garden is also really nice. Um, different varieties of roses, different colors, ang gaganda. So when we visited Chongshe, it was the stargazer season. So marami siyang stargazer in different colors. 
At meron din silang dinagdag na strawberry plantation na pwede kayong uh, bumili ng strawberries. Yummy, Chloe? Yes, yeah, it's good. Yeah. Since it's a flower market, you can buy seeds or seedlings na mga flowers na available like this here. I think these are daisies. They call that daisies. At syempre hindi mawawala yung orchids dito sa Taiwan. Maraming orchids. At ngayon, ito naman yung amaryllis. Different varieties din to kinokolek ng mama ko to. So, pwede siyang bilhin. Yan. Para di lang puti para gilong. May itlog na rin, ha? Oh, may mga honey. Para di lang. Para di lang. Para di lang. Para di lang. Sa labas ng farm, meron silang plant store where you can buy seeds na mga flowers or vegetables. Um, marami ding mga choices.